hello everyone welcome to solve this nice math olympiad algebra problem so here we have m plus n equals 10 and m n equals 200 uh, so we solve this problem for the values of m and n so here first we call this is our equation number one and we call this is our equation number two so here uh, first we focus on equation number one uh, so that from uh, uh, equation number one we have and uh, here we move this m to the right hand side so we get the value of n is equals to 10 minus m so we call this is our equation number three okay so further uh, here we need to substitute this value of n in equation number two uh, so that uh, here we just write it as equation number two is implies that this is m times of n and the value of n is 10 minus m is equals to 100 so further uh, you see here we need to multiply this m on both of these terms so it will be written as 10 m minus m square equals to 100 so now this equation will become a quadratic in m variable but not in standard form so that now first we write this into the standard form uh, for this we need to move these two values to the right hand side so it will be written as m squared because when you move this minus m squared to the right hand side it will become plus m squared this is positive 10 m becomes minus 10 m and this is plus 100 equals to 0 okay so further uh, we uh, need to solve this quadratic equation so here first we write the coefficients of this equation and the coefficients of this equation are a equals to 1 b equals to minus 10 and c is equals to 100 so these are the coefficients of the above equation and now now here we need to use the quadratic formula in order to solve the above quadratic equation so you know that uh, the quadratic formula will be stated as minus b plus minus square root of b square minus 4 times of ac divided by 2 times of a so this is the over nice quadratic formula and now here we need to substitute this uh, the values of a b and c uh, in this quadratic formula so here we have the value of b is minus 10 uh, it will be written as minus times of minus 10 and plus minus square root of b square so b is minus 10 square minus 4 times of ac the value of a is 1 and the value of c becomes here 100 and it is divided by 2 times of a so the value of a is equals to 1 so further you see here we need some simplification so now you see that this minus times of minus will become here plus 10 and plus minus square root of minus the square of minus becomes uh, plus or the square of 10 becomes here 100 and minus this is 4 times of 100 becomes 400 and it is divided by 2 times of 1 is equals to 2 and now here we need more simplification so we write it as m equals 10 plus minus uh, here when you subtract 100 minus 400 so it will be equals to minus 300 and it is divided by 2 so after that here we need to focus on this radical term so here uh, you have a negative sign inside the rad uh, radical or square root so here we need to separate the square root on both of these terms and it will be written as 10 plus minus square root of 300 into square root of minus 1 divided by 2 so after this step we have m equals this is 10 plus minus here we rewrite this 300 as 100 multiplied by 3 we know that 100 times of 3 becomes 300 and the square root of minus 1 becomes iota and it is divided by 2 
so further you see here we uh, apply this radical sign separately on both of these terms and it will be written as 10 plus minus uh, square root of 100 into square root of 3 into iota divided by 2 and here we know that the square root of 100 is equals to 10 so this will become 10 times of square root of 3 into iota and uh, similarly uh, here we just break this fraction and we write these two separately on both of these two terms okay uh, so after that uh, here you need to uh, simplify the terms so this is 2 5 are 10 and 2 5 are 10 so we get here 5 plus minus 5 times of square root of 3 into iota so these are the two complex values of m so here uh, from these two values of m we need to find the corresponding values of n yeah, so that here first uh, we uh, we uh, separate these two values and we have the positive value of m is 5 plus 5 into uh, square root of 3 iota and the negative value is 5 minus 5 into square root of 3 iota so these are the two values of m so here we need equation number 3 so that uh, equation number 3 is implies that n is equals to 10 minus m and now we substitute uh, the above two values of m in this equation and we get the corresponding values of n uh, so that here we divide this in two cases so first we substitute this value of m here and it will becomes n equals 10 minus m and the value of m is 5 plus 5 times of square root of 3 into iota okay here we need to multiply this negative sign on each of these terms it will be written as 10 minus 5 minus 5 into square root of 3 iota so we get 10 minus 5 becomes 5 minus 5 into square root of 3 into iota so this is the uh, value of n corresponding to the value of uh, m is this one okay so similarly we uh, move the second case so here we need to substitute this value of m here and it will be written as n equals to 10 minus m the value of m in that case is 5 minus 5 into square root of 3 into iota okay so here we need to multiply this negative sign on each of these terms then it will be written as 10 minus 5 plus 5 into square root of 3 iota so here we get the value of n equals to 10 minus 5 becomes 5 plus 5 into square root of 3 iota so this is the value of n corresponding to the value of m is this one okay so finally we have uh, the two solutions of the given equation are the first solution is m1 and n1 is equals to uh, uh, okay so we write these two uh, combined solutions so we have uh, first solution is the value of m is 5 plus 5 into square root of 3 iota and the value of corresponding value of n is 5 minus 5 into square root of 3 iota this is the first solution and similarly the second solution is the value of m is 5 minus 5 into square root of 3 iota and the value of n is 5 plus 5 into square root of 3 iota so this is the final answer of this problem and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos